understanding, how many days a week are you pressing? It was three. Now it's now it's two. All right. If you're going to be a big presser, you've got to press three days a week, probably four. Okay. And the reason for that is uh, that the reason for that is because the press, more so than any of the other lifts that we do, is extremely dependent on bar path. It is exquisitely right. dependent on mechanics. Now, if you are just not pressing enough, you're not going to be good at keeping the bar in the groove it has to stay in. All right. The the groove uh, in the press is going to be de- is is going to determine how mechanically efficient the the bar path is with respect to the distance between the barbell and your shoulder. So shoulder, barbell, elbow, all have to be as close together as you can keep them. And the only way to make that go in a real giant heavy press is to have practiced that bar path, practiced the bar groove over and over and over again for thousands of reps. All right, Chase presses five, four days a week yep. and has, right. has done that for a long time. And, you know, a 405 press at a, at, a, at a 250 body weight, I don't think there's anybody in the country doing that. Uh, is so. anybody else in the country doing it right now? And uh, I, I think that the four-day-a-week press is real, real critical to his success with that lift. Uh, I could see using dynamic effort triples or doubles, probably. I would probably use dynamic effort doubles for 10 sets on one of those days. I would do five sets of five. I would do heavy singles. I'd do dynamic effort doubles, and then I'd do pin presses. Those would be the four workouts I would use. But All in one week? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I know. It doesn't leave enough, a lot of room for bench pressing, but you need to bench once every couple of weeks, too. You need to bench. All right. But, yeah, if you're going to work toward a big press, like you're going to try to – you're weighing 245 right now, you're going to – I mean, you're going to have a big – you can say you have a big press when you're up in the low 300s. All right. right. But what's, if you're going to get there, you're going to have to press four days a week. What's the press number now? How much are you pressing? I did uh, 230 a few weeks ago, but I think I've gotten a bit stronger since then. Yeah. So, See, let's say you're 235, 240. You've still got quite a ways to go. Sure. You're not even bench press. You're not pressing body weight yet. Yeah. Body right. weight's a starting place for a big press. And especially only doing it twice a day. He's going to you're going to respond really twice well a week. to yeah, adding he's... another or twice a week adding another day, adding two more days, you're going to respond very well. Um, what I would do is I'd start off right now and I'd be pressing 3 days a week and I'd do that for a couple of months and then I would add the fourth day like every other week. Yep. And then I would go to 4 days. Yeah, I, I I think you should dump the dynamic effort for a while until your press gets up higher. When yeah, gets, I don't think it's of any use to you right it's now. It's too light. It's too light. Um, right. It, you you got to be pressing heavy, and by heavy, you, the singles are what's what's heavy, um, and you need to be doing that every week. Because it's real easy to do a light weight in the groove. The right. problem with practicing the press is that if you don't handle heavy weights, the tiniest little bit out of the groove. A centimeter out of the groove on a press is the difference between making the press, locking it out at the top, and a miss forward. So uh, it's real easy to groove 65% for uh, dynamic effort sets, all right? But it's not good practice because it doesn't force you to keep the an efficient bar path. Because it's light and you can do it wrong, and it's not heavy enough to really make you stronger either. You're just no, accumulating really, it's a not. Bunch it's a it, it, dynamic effort presses would be a light day, a, a light day work, which you probably don't even need for a press. Not right now. Right. 